Hello Taurus, Someone Rising and Venus and welcome to another reading. Keep in mind that the energies can be vice versa also. Keep in mind that this reading may or may not resonate for you. If it doesn't, feel free to check out your other placements. What's the overall energy between Taurus and the person Taurus is connecting with or will be connecting with? Okay, so we do have heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other. A lot of people are getting heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Getting to know each other as you reveal your normal selves to each other, your bond deepens, along with make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you are guided to take. I do like that. It's looking so far so good. We'll see. How does Taurus come and view this relationship? Whoa. Okay, so we got the Ace of Wands here. It could be connecting with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag, with the Knight of Swords, Gemini, along with the Ten of Swords, more Gemini energy. Let me clean the lens really quickly. Alrighty, see, I knew something was wrong with the lens. All right, now a reference to how you're currently viewing this relationship, still keep in mind that the energies could be vice versa, Taurus, so this could be the person that you're connecting with. Um, it doesn't necessarily have to be you, but for the sake of the reading, I'm going to refer it to it's you, okay? Um, now a reference to how you're viewing uh, this relationship here, it does look like something came to an end here um, rather quickly. I'm kind of looking at it as... There was some sort of ending here that I kind of feel like you initiated, possibly. And I kind of feel like it came from a place of um, impulse. Like, you didn't necessarily think things through. And I kind of feel like you just reacted, to be quite honest here, which created an ending here. But I do, I do see you, especially with this Ace of Swords here to the Four of Wands, I do see you coming in to kind of change the circumstances. Uh, between you and this person here and trying to kind of make things right I, again I kind of feel like you made this decision to kind of end things with this person and I feel like you did it out of impulse I don't necessarily feel like you thought things through um I just kind of feel like you did it out of impulse where you were feeling really stressed really overwhelmed and I kind of feel like you just you did what you had to do to get yourself out of the situation of feeling stressed and overthinking things and feeling overwhelmed and feeling scattered. So I kind of feel like you just decided to end things with this person without thinking things through. But I kind of feel like you're you're kind of rushing in, taking action to change the circumstances between you and this person. What actions? I mean, what actions? See, I'm already like... All right. How does this person currently view this relationship with Taurus? <clears throat> so we have the Five of Cups here, Scorpio energy, the Five of Swords here, Aquarius with the Strength card here, Leo. There's a lot of disappointment, a lot of sadness here. Um, Obviously, I don't necessarily feel like this person took this ending um, great. Uh, I don't think so, but I feel like they're trying their best to really pull themselves together and kind of see this through here. And, and it is a little bit difficult for this person to accept the fact that, you know, things came to an end between you and them. Um, I don't feel like they, they've gone over this whatsoever. I do feel like they still have a tendency of kind of reflecting on how things ended and the way things transpired here between you and them. I'm also getting a feeling of uh, this person's really biting down on their tongue. Like they're not really saying anything to you. Um, they're really keeping to themselves. We really are. Now, when it comes down to the lovers here, you could be dealing with a Gemini here. This person feels a very strong soul tie connection to you. There is a lot of love that this person has for you and for this relationship and the fact that it's, it's kind of like this decision that you chose to make as far as ending things with this person goes and possibly acting out of impulse because you found yourself kind of like cornered is what I want to say. Um, <clears throat> it led to a lot of hurt feelings for this person. It did. It really did. It really did. But it happens. But I just kind of feel like this person's really biting down on their tongue here, not really saying anything to you. 
I feel like this person's really kind of keeping to themselves here. How does Taurus feel about this relationship? Got the Three of Pentacles, Capricorn energy. Got the Nine of Cups here, Pisces. With the Fool here, Aries, also Aquarius. Yeah, yeah. Yikes. Well, I mean, kind of looks like there was some sort of fire argument here. I just, I just kind of feel like you were a little bit cornered, to be quite honest. I feel like you were really cornered. Um, but I just kind of feel like this ending here by you walking away and acting out of impulse possibly, it created a lot of pain, but a lot of pain for the both of you, to be quite honest. A lot of pain for the both of you. And I still kind of feel like it's interesting because I feel like to a certain extent you're trying to kind of put it past you and not acknowledge it and just move on with your life, but you're struggling. You're really struggling to do so, and I, I kind of feel like that's why you're taking action in this person's direction. Now, Three of Pentacles here and the Nine of Cups, <clears throat> you're hoping um, that the two of you can come back together and kind of make things, um, you know, work out between you and them. It's almost in a sense, too, where you just want to kind of start over. It's like you messed up. You made a mistake and you messed up, and we've all been there, done that. It was it was a mistake, um, and I kind of feel like you felt, like I said, cornered and, and, and like, uh, like overwhelmed and just stressed out, and I kind of feel like you, you did what you thought was best for you at the time um, without thinking, but I do feel like you want to come back together with this person to make things right, but you want to start over. You want to start over. How does this person feel about this relationship with Tortoise? Yeah. Got the hangman, Pisces, the lovers. Again, Gemini. With the Three of Cups wanting to reconcile with you, wanting to come back together with you, but they're showing up as a hangman. So again, yeah, I wouldn't say that this person's being stubborn. I wouldn't say that. Um, it, it's almost in a sense where whatever happened and took place between you and this person really left a bad taste in this person's mouth. And it's almost in a sense where this person is taking some time out to really think if this is something that they want to do. Ultimately, let's be honest, between me and you, I kind of feel like this person wants to reconcile with you because they have a lot of love for you and because, let's be honest, they really do want to balance things out uh, between you and this person and they really do want this relationship to work out. So yeah, do I feel like, you know, they're going to be acting on it and doing something about it? No, I don't see this person doing it. If anything, I see you putting in all the effort and the work to kind of show this person that you want to start over. And uh, oh my gosh, I started choking just a little bit. Uh, that you want, you know, you want things to work out here and, and they want the same things. The problem is they're not doing anything about it. They're not doing anything. They're very, very reserved to be quite honest here. They want to reconcile, but don't see this person doing anything. Kind of just see them standing still here, not wanting to say anything too. That's another thing. It's almost in a sense where this person's really biting down on their tongue right now because they don't have anything nice to say to you. They don't have anything nice to say to you. So to them, they rather avoid it, avoid the conflict, avoid the fighting, and avoid the arguments. Um, and to them, they rather just kind of keep to themselves here. But they're thinking about a reconciliation with you. Again, not acting on it, not really doing anything. What action will Taurus take towards this person or moving forward? Got the Queen of Swords here. We got the Eight of Cups. And there goes that Five of Swords. Again. will this person take towards Taurus and moving forward? Yeah. Queen of Swords twice. Yikes. 
the Five of Wands, Leo energy, to the Star card here, Aquarian energy. I just kind of, I just kind of, how can I explain this? I just feel like, okay, in reference to how you, the two of you choose to kind of go forward here, I kind of feel like the both of you are harnessing the same energy where I kind of feel like you're defending your position almost in a sense where you're kind of explaining to this person like the reason why I acted the way that I acted, the reason why I did what I did, the reason why I ended things the way that I ended things, you know, things like that. Um, you're, I kind of feel like you're explaining to this person why you did what you did and their kind of, their rebuttal is, you know, that could have been avoided. It could have been avoided here. We could have healed the situation. It didn't have to like escalate someone else got a similar reading to this i forgot who it was it could have been leo to be quite honest you could be dealing with a leo but i kind of feel like it's like the both of you trying to defend your position right where you left a bad taste in this person's mouth you're explaining why you did what you did the both of you are having a hard time getting over it because you're defending your position and they're just like well i don't necessarily agree with how you chose to handle things taurus um and I kind of feel like, again, with that Eight of Cups energy, you want to kind of leave the past in the past and move forward here and get past this. And I feel like so do they. I do. But I kind of feel like it's going to be like a round two sort of situation here where um, you're coming in and you're really defending your position. Kind of, like I said, telling this person, listen, I did this because of this. And they're just like, no. No, 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 no. You did it because of this, that, and the third. That's why you did it. I, I do see a little bit of an argument happening again, um, but in this case though, Taurus, I don't see you feeding into it. It's almost in a sense where now the world, the, oh, I can't say that because my tongue won't let me. You know, like things are flipped. <laughs> things are now flipped here where this person's like, no, I don't want to argue with you. And now you're just like, okay, neither do I. I don't want to argue with you anymore. And now this person's like, no, nah, now I want to argue with you. You know, now it's my turn to say whatever it is that I need to say and get whatever I need to get off my chest here. Again, the whole goal here is to kind of move past this. And I feel like the both of you want to move past this and heal the situation. But I kind of feel like there is going to be some sort of argument that's going to take place first. And I kind of feel like there's a lot that you need to get off your chest here. Again, you don't want to argue with this person, but this person is going to definitely want to argue with you. Um, I do see that happening. I do see that happening here. It's kind of like this person's kind of looking at the situation, right? Is it this? Yeah, it's this one over here. This person over here. Kind of out of one, so the seven of swords here. Yeah, I just kind of feel like they're looking at it like, now it's my turn, you know, now it's my turn. Because to them, it's like, um, I wouldn't say that that's the case entirely, but it, it's kind of like, now it's my turn to start some stuff, you know. Um, you're, you have to remember that this person, it's like the way things transpired, they kind of kept quiet. And that's just going to build up and fester. And that's what you're seeing here um, is the build up. And they're just coming right out and kind of telling you off more than likely here. Because they have a whole lot to say. And remember, they go from, oh, I'll think about it, I'll think about it, I'll think about it, to, all right, let's do this. And I kind of feel like they're, they're heading back in your direction here because of the simple fact that it's like building up on the inside. It's building up, building up, building up. And it's like, now nah, I have something to say. Now I have something to say to you. And it's, it, again, I don't think that this person has anything nice to say. I don't. But I kind of feel like you're trying to kind of see things from their perspective here. Again, I don't necessarily feel like you want to fight with this person. I just kind of feel like you want to work things out. Any advice for Taurus? Do you have reconciliation? Someone from your past is returning to your life. What else do we have? Healing family issues, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. Then we have it safe for you to love, open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. Yeah, I mean, the two of you are going to come back together here and try to heal the situation. Unfortunately, they don't have anything nice to say to you. But again, they find it to be very healing to kind of just get this off their chest. Because again, they were holding in a lot. Definitely biting down on their tongue, not saying anything. And it's just coming out. I mean, it might as well. Um... 
come out unfortunately so that way they're not moving forward with you holding this sense of like resentment towards you or anger towards you it's just coming out it is what it is um but it's going to kind of cause the two of you to kind of move past this it's unfortunate that it has to kind of happen this way but this person's just pissed off at you i don't know what else to say and you're just like i don't want to fight anymore I don't want to fight, I don't want to fight, I don't want to fight, let's move past this. And they're just like, no, I got something to tell you, Taurus. I got something to tell you. So, oh no. Uh, well, there you have it. So hopefully this reading resonates with you. Hopefully it brings you some clarity in regards to whoever it is that you're connecting with or will be connecting with. And I will see you guys at your next reading. Bye.